There we go guys, first fish of the day. Well, it looks beautiful down here. Hello everyone, welcome back. Hope you have an amazing day. Just getting on the Detroit River right now. Uh, the water actually looks pretty crystal clear. I got a little bit of a slight east wind right now and it is super, super hot outside. Uh, right now the water levels are really, really high. So, uh, I guess they closed down all the docks, the Sal Ramp, Chewit, um, City Marina, all those places because they're actually doing reconstruction. So I'm going to be fishing on shore a lot. Today I'm in search for some smallies. Uh, as you guys can see, right there in my hand, right here, I'm going to be jigging some tubes. I'm going to be three, using a three quarter ounce tube jig and I'm going to be in search for these giant bronze backs. Hopefully, I get some nice coloration ones, some nice fights. We'll see how we do though. Uh, with the mayfly hatch that just happened, it's very, very tough. There's a lot of debris in the water, a lot of bugs, so that's what they've been feeding on. So they actually have like a buffet down there. It'll be a little bit tougher to fish, but hopefully I still even land into something. I think I will. Anyways, guys, here we go. Let's get some fishing. Let's do this. So as you guys can see, I got a tube jig right here. Uh, this is a tube slipped over a three quarter ounce jig on the inside. A three quarter ounce jig on the inside there. It's a long tube jig. Uh, I like to go a heavy jig because the Detroit River is really, really deep. But I get some nice big junkies on here, so let's do this. There we go guys, first fish of the day. Oh, yep, yeah, smallmouth. First smallmouth of the day, guys. Oh, did you see that jump up? Here we go.
Oh yes, there we go guys. Not even here a few minutes. Same thing. Check out that tube jig. Nice smallmouth right there. It's gotta say, let's let's get, let's get a weight on this. I got a scale here. All right, stand across, baby. Woo! That was awesome. Not even ten minutes here. All right, let's get a weight. One point one six kilograms, right there. One point one six kilograms. Check that, guys. Right there. <clears throat> That's a nice big fat smallie. It's about uh, well, I weighed it. <clears throat> it was one point one six kilograms on the scale there. And uh, when you convert that, that would be your weight. Roughly about a little two and a half pounder. Beautiful fish, beautiful fish, but let it go. Okay. Yes, yes, there we go. There's my bass that I released. Go. So it stayed a long time, right? Oh yeah, you never know. You, you don't know, I don't know. I don't know how long. Is that bad, eh? Yeah, it's good. Good size, perfect. 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 Steam perfect. Jump, don't jump. Coming? Yeah, don't jump, don't jump. I want no jump. Oh. oh. Thank you. Lucky. Thank you. Woo! Check one. Yeah. Is he lucky, eh? <laughs> Both about three pounds there. Woo! Hold on, so I'm gonna get this on the camera real quick. You guys can see the sheer size of this. All right. Okay, good luck, eh? Yeah, thank you. Lucky one. Yeah. yeah. All right, guys, check that out. That's another giant smallie there. Not super giant, but it is super chunky. Nice three pounder, beautiful coloring. Look at that. Oh yeah, coming out of the short river, I was using a three quarter ounce tube jig. Nice uh, pumpkin color. So I'm gonna release this in a second. All right guys, here's that smallie right there. Nice big fat chunky one. Beautiful coloration coming out of the short river here. And back she goes, look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Micro killer, bro. Laugh now, but cry later when it fits in its mouth. Hey? <laughs> okay? 
I tried to use the big jigs. I missed a lot of fish with them. I was like, well, you know what? I'm going to switch the size up. Then I started getting them. And I was like, okay. I was using those jumps before. And then I stopped using them. They're too, they're, 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 there's too much plastic. They're too big. This one here, 2.5. Yo, yeah. Fish on. Fish on. It's bass. <laughs> oh, it's a sheep! Bad. Oh, terrible! Get out of here! Where is she? Hey, it's up the bit! Thank you, Ahem! Here you go, guys. There you go, on the tube. Back into the water it goes. <laughs> and all the rest are like the little tiny dinkers. I wouldn't consider them dinkers because the ones I watch in people's videos, come on. Except for the one that AP just caught. Did you see that one? On John B's The Never Top Tour? Where there was, there it is. Oh, fuck. I felt it hit my line too. See? See? Did you see that? Did you see that? I, I sat still and it came back. It's a bass. Yeah, get the net. I knew it. I felt it. Nice one too. There she comes. Oh, yeah. Boom. There you go. Another bass. Woo! Nice Jigging on the tube. Hitting the tube, baby. Oh, yeah. You guys can see. Here you go. Good job, B. On the tube again. There you go, Wood City. How you doing, brother? <laughs> There you go. Yep, got one. Yep, bass. You might jump in. Don't jump, don't jump, don't jump, don't jump. Right here, right here. Don't jump. Don't jump, don't jump, don't jump. Don't jump. Don't jump. Oh, nice. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Woo! Okay. Awesome. Thank you, sir. I appreciate it. <laughs> Yay. All right, guys. There you go. Another smallmouth bass. I have to say about a one and a half pounder there. Nice, nice size, nice color there. Beautiful. Check that out. Back to the water she goes. 
Thank you. and it came back. You need a spool. Could be a muskie. Could be. Oh my god. Oh, we have to follow it. Yeah. We'll have to follow it. What is this, yo? I was like, oh, I missed and it came back. Yeah. What is it? It's a sheep. It's a big sheep. Oh, I see it, eh? No, I can feel it. Holy cow, man. Come on. It's me. I don't know if this is a sheep. I don't know what this is, bro. Seriously. I don't know if it's a sheep. I don't know if it's a sheep. If, if it's one of those muskies again, I'm gonna fucking crap myself. Are we following this down the river or what? Is it? That's a big giant. Watch the watch the light. Oh. card in there why don't you put it in oh there it is oh this is that drum is that my pv drum yeah hey yeah that has to be a pv yeah. drum yeah. Yeah. oh my god that has to be a master yeah. angler drum holy cow <laughs> yeah. she king Holy smokes, bro. Let me get a sheer shot of this for a second. <laughs> oh man. Keep that king. After all that, on a tube. What do you think? How many inches do you think this is? Bro, that's at least 30. By far 30, right? Look at this. Hold oh, up. look at it go. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> that was real human piss. That peed everywhere. I'm glad I didn't grab it. Oh my god, that's long. Like, hold on, guess what? Look at this. From my head to my waist. Jeez. Wow. Is that big, bro? Oh, buddy. Is that big? That's a drum and a half. Don't worry, man. I'm about to let this thing go. Oh my god. Biggest sheep I ever caught. I don't even know why I let that thing go. I'm yeah, just kidding. <laughs> I should have ate it. <laughs> Thank you, AM. Alright guys. That was actually a fascinating day. 
I ended up with a bunch of small malls, a couple three pounders, a couple of medium sized ones. They all fought very well. And I actually caught a couple of sheephead also. That was a huge, huge one at the end that I caught with AM there. It fought very well. The water is actually crystal clear. It's starting to get super windy. The mayflies are still out there. So it's, it is a tough bite. You gotta really work for them. I was using this three quarter ounce jig right here with the pumpkin seed tube. If you guys decide to come out here, just find that bottom and keep jigging it. And uh, another tip that I use, once you feel a bite, I like to pause for like two or three seconds because what happens is that delay will cause that fish to go for it a second time. The current usually drags your lure away, so once you pause for that quick second, you'll get that hit. Anyways guys, until next time, enjoy that fishing. Signing off.